Hey guys, Ryan here. Um, just back from a, a bit of a break. Um, it's been very busy 2015. Um, you know, a lot of work has went into the video presentations on the channel here, um, such as Glam's Castle, which was the, the last major one that I completed and it took a lot out of me um, to, to film that and to obviously produce it. Um, in addition to that, as you can imagine, especially people who um, know all about Echovox, um, I really analyse these files um, thoroughly and it does take a lot of work out. So I needed a, a little break at that point. Um, but now feeling recharged, um, it's time to start thinking about moving forward into 2016 and exactly what we can do for presentations on the channel here. Um, what do people want to see? So this is a quick video just to, to ask, what do you want to see on the channel here? Do you enjoy the location videos? Um, would you uh, like to see more Echovox videos? Would you like to see me filming as I use Echovox? Um, how about instructions? How about settings that we use? Um, how do you feel about talking about deeper subjects like the nature of reality? Um, synchronicities? Um, and all these kind of things, near-death experiences, um, out-of-body experiences. These are all things that I've studied, but I haven't really put out on this channel. I have spoke about them on the website through articles and things, but I haven't really made any um, videos going into this area. My preference was to present Scotland and the locations and mostly keep myself out of the video um, mostly being due to the fact that it was less about me and more about um, the work. I have had a few messages though and comments that have been left um, wishing a more personal interaction, um, wanting me to go into what I have experienced over 10 years of paranormal research and study and um, some of the subjects I've looked into, which vary from paranormal spirit going all the way through to, as I say, nature of reality and um, ancient mysteries and all this kind of stuff. Um, so it's really putting out to you, the subscribers, the people who have subscribed to watch the channel here, and it'd be good to know what you want to see, why you subscribed, um, what you would like to see on the channel. And we could take a few of those options and we could, not to get all obviously everybody to get um, something that they enjoy, we could um, we could shake it up a little. I am still going to continue to do um, more of the locations, going along to a location, do a little bit Echo Vox, tell a little bit of the history and um, see what we can find where we're there. For the, the angle of trying to prove um, that spirit exists or the paranormal, I don't need to do that any longer. And, and if you're here for looking for me to either debunk or overly prove something, it's not really going to work because I know, I know um, that there is spirit and I know that we have paranormal activity um, going on. And I've done a lot of years as a research and investigator and in those early years, it was about that. It was about getting that um, proof or debunking something and my mind's shifted because of my experiences since then. So it's more about presenting what I come across now. Now that will include um, showing you audio files and um, get, giving you some evidence at different points, but I'm not really into debunking. I'm never ever going to put out a video that um, debunks a haunting or or trying to, or, or setting up tons and tons of equipment and trying to um, really dig deep into something because I've done that. I've been there um, and although it's great and I, and I really do appreciate people who do do it, don't get me wrong, but for me, my, my, my focus has shifted. My focus is more onto the fact of showing you what's there, telling the story, telling the history and, um, you know, get, getting some of the best evidence, but digging deeper, diving deeper into, you know, yeah, it's there. Now, how can we experience that directly? How can we go further into that? What does it mean for our lives as well? You know, how can we use that for, for our benefit, if you like? Um, you know, rather than just 
turning up at a location and 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 doing some um, work and and then leaving it at that. Can we can we shake it up further? So um, if if you like these ideas, let me know down in the comments box, and um, and also the suggestions of what you would like to see more of. You know, it's very easy for me to put out material. And I will always put out material that I love and my passion, but I also want to to interact with people on the channel. You know, there's over a thousand subscribers on this channel here. Um, it's been going along for, for, for a few years now. Um, on, on the top of that, I've got 10 years of experience and I don't mind sharing it. If people want to take some of the experiences I've got and some of the, the knowledge and information and use it for their own groups, for their own research, um, their own personal um, stuff that they want to do, I, I'm open to sharing that. Um, I've always been about sharing. I, d I don't hide information. Um, so if you like those ideas, let me know. And um, I'll see what the feedback is like, and um, we can see where we can go from there. Um, I have been thinking lately about what my position going forward is going to be. Once you do this for a long time, you have to look and see where the road is going. Um, and I think my focus is going to be more now on helping others. Um, there's nothing more that I need personally out of it. Um, so if I can help others um, gain their own experiences and their own evidence, and um, improve their own lives as well because when you realise that there's more to life than this mundane stuff we see in the news and things um, it's very magical and we can then start digging deeper and really living a life of purpose so let me know what you think I'll keep this short and um, I, I will read all the feedback and I will be thinking more deeply on this and I will get some more material I have Tons and tons of material and files here. And I'm also going to do some more location visits. It's, it's windy, it's blowing a gale just now, it's early in the morning. Um, obviously it's going to be hard to get the drone up, um, but I'll see what I can do. Just before I go, we've got some new tools that we could use. We've got the, the DJI Osmo. Um, I'm, I could go into these things if you want to look at the equipment that we've got. We could go in there and talk about that as well. I will leave it there just now. Um, thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing uh, and thank you for all the support um, if you're new please do subscribe, do comment and do share the videos as well and um, yeah I'll catch up in the next video, speak more soon